Hey Vern here. I got this uh, dart gun here that I made because I wanted a high power dart gun. I was tired of blowing them really hard, so uh, I just wanted to be able to shoot them, just pull the trigger, and there you go. I'm gonna show you a close up video here, and, uh, and after that, I'll shoot it, see what it does on all the uh, hot pan. Alright, so here we got a uh, close up of my dart gun. We got uh, five CO2 cartridges and a uh, shotgun shell holder. Got my uh, battery right here, 12 volt lead acid. Um, here I got my CO2 uh, plug, whatever you want to call it. Uh, put the CO2 cartridge in that. Then you can put this on the Schrader valve like this. Screw that on. Push the trigger, pressurize it, and just stick it back in here for a uh, portable use. Got my uh, 100 psi psi gauge, pressure gauge, uh, quarter inch Schrader valve, 3 8 inch uh, 12 volt solenoid, little uh, switch right here. Push that, and it goes. Got this all wired up here. Got a little uh, adapter to my barrel half inch. So I'm with a 50 caliber blowgun. My four inch darts there. Got eight of those. Got my foregrip. Got my uh, stinger darts. And my stun darts. All right, so I'm about ready to shoot this. And uh, I loaded up one of my stun darts here. It's going to be, uh, I'm not sure how well it's going to penetrate, but we'll see. See how it works. Let me uh, get my high speed video here going. We're good to go. Nice. <laughs> Alright, well that was uh, more than I expected. It uh, pushed it. You can see the uh, entrance wound right there. Have it bent in right there. Split that apart and then exited here. So you see it'll peel back. So it actually went all the way through and then it exploded and went out. So uh, yeah, that was pretty good. I still haven't found the dart yet so I'll be looking for that for a while.